Hello and welcome. This is Ashima Minocha and you're watching It's Tomorrow News. Typhoon Sodalor made landfall in Hualien County, Taiwan early Saturday at 5 a.m. The storm during landfall has the maximum sustained winds of 120 miles per hour leading to tremendous rainfall on Taiwan's mountains. At least four people died and 27 others were injured and around 2,000 people were relocated from Taiwan's outlying islands. Typhoon Sodalor is now no longer a super typhoon but is still a very dangerous typhoon with its strength equal to Category 2 hurricane in Pacific or Atlantic Ocean. Typhoon Sodalor produced wind gusts of 163 km per hour at Sueyu on the northeast coast of Taiwan. The mountain in Daetong Township in Yilan County has already received 1,241 mm, that is 48.86 inches of rain. The capital of Taiwan, Taipei, received 311.5 mm, that is 12.26 inches of rain, with a wind gust of 86 miles per hour. But some areas of the city, Taipei, reported more than 500 mm, that is 20 inches of rain. About 2 million people of Taiwan were without power at the time of landfall of Typhoon Sodalor. More than 1,58,000 people have been evacuated ahead of the storm in southeastern China's Fujian province. Eastern China will be the next final target of Typhoon Sodalor. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's Tomorrow News, Ashima Minocha.